In the game of bridge, exacting communication with your partner is essential. To communicate well with your computer partner in Bridge Baron, you must first set up the conventions and signals to use, just as you would agree upon a set of conventions with another human partner before playing in a game, at a club, or with your friends. We call this set of agreements a pair profile. On the main menu, you see a button labeled Convention Card Setup. Click on it to set the convention card that you and your partner, North and South, will use. Depending on how you answered the questions when you first installed the game, your screen may not look exactly like this, but it will be similar. Bridge Baron comes programmed with 21 preset pair profiles. To select one of these, simply click the drop-down menu next to where it says Profile Name and find the one that you want to use. The most popular choices in the United States are variations of the standard American yellow card system, abbreviated here as SAYC and STDAM. Select one of the options that you think might be right for you, and you will notice that the screen has updated itself to display all the agreements that you have selected. Take a moment to read the information on the screen and see if it describes the system that you know and want to play. The convention card I have selected shows that I will be using the conventions Unusual No Trump and Michaels, for example. Information about all the conventions is available in our help file. If you do not know or do not want to play with any of the conventions displayed, perhaps you should try selecting another, simpler, preset pair profile. If you are unable to find a preset pair profile that matches how you would like to play, you may also create your own. A detailed discussion of how to do this is available in a separate Bridge Baron tutorial entitled Creating a Customized Pair Profile. After choosing your convention card, there are a couple more things to set to finish your pair profile. First, you can set your point count method. Most players in the United States choose either the long suit point count method or the short suit point count method. Next, you need to decide on a skill level for your partner to play at. To do this, click on the arrow and hold your mouse button down, scrolling left and right. As you would expect, the higher skill level you ask Bridge Baron to play at, the longer the program will take to think about his play. Skill level 1 will make a decision instantly, with no delay, but might not play quite as well as the program is capable of playing. On the other extreme, at skill level 41, the program will play at its absolute best, but each decision can take as long as two minutes. As you scroll, directly below the bar, you can see the absolute maximum amount of time that Bridge Baron will take for each bid or play. It's all about finding the balance between skill and speed that works best for you. When you were setting your convention card, if you saw conventions that you didn't know, or ones that you weren't completely comfortable using, you may be interested in our teaching program, Learn and Practice Bidding Conventions. For a complete refresher on all the basics of bidding and playing bridge, we also offer Introduction to Bridge, Play and Learn with Pat Harrington. Designed with the complete novice in mind, it makes an excellent gift for a friend or family member that wants to get involved in the great game of bridge. For more information about these and all of our products, please visit our website at www.greatgameproducts.com.